I suppose uh, after 840 days um, of the last PETA event prior to COVID, um, it's really a great experience for the members of PETA to get back together in Fiji, which was the original venue of PETA 26 years ago. So, um, and there's been a lot of goodwill, um, a lot of excitement, and I've got to say that um, face-to-face -face meetings can't be beating, beaten by the virtual world, you know. There's a lot of business that's done outside of the plenary conferences, and we have a plethora of vendors from New Zealand and Australia making the most of the opportunity. So as a result of COVID, we've had to adapt the way we run our meetings. So we're now running a, a hybrid version of, of conferences where we have online attendees and people in person. So at the moment, we've probably got about 120 people in, in person and upwards of 180 uh, attendees online. So it's a very effective way to, to run a conference. It uh, broadens the reach of um, access to panelists and, and sessions. And um, we've been able to attract a broad range of industry experts have, that have shared a lot of uh, valuable knowledge. Part of being able to meet face to face is it's not just the direct business during the business day but it's the social networking in the evenings and to be honest that's where the real business is conducted, that's where the real honest conversations are held and often uh, that's where the deals are sealed um, in, in the social gathering so um, it's a very, very valuable component of, of conferences and, and, and the networking after hours. All right. So, you know, part, part of the interaction from our members online was the desire to be here in person. And there's a number of countries that still have border restrictions, so it's not not because they can't, not because they don't want to be here, it's because they can't get here. So, as the borders open, we're going to see much more in-person uh, representation. Um, but, um, you know, the, the people who, who managed to get here, uh, we're really appreciative of that. People who joined online, uh, most of them wish they were here as well.